three o'clock in the morning. Uh, I might as well just get up, watch some television. All of us, uh, congratulations. We'll see you down the road. Kareem Abdul Jabbar may have been the bread and butter. No. Oh, if I have to listen to one more sad animal story. Oh, where are the happy stories? Does anybody save these dogs? Tonight, on TBSHR's award-winning news program, 420 Minutes, an in-depth, behind-the-scenes look at Tasia Blue Siberian Husky Rescue. No kibble will be left behind. Out of the kennel and into the yard. And in her first public interview, we'll hear their founder, Tasia Blue, tell us in her own words the harrowing tale from homeless to international fame. Yeah, I really didn't want to do this interview, but they offered me a lifetime supply of bones. A lifetime supply had to be done. Well, my name is Tasia Blue. I am the Chief Dog Officer at Tasia Blue Siberian Husky Rescue. We've become the largest husky rescue in the Midwest. We save the lives of nearly 100 huskies each year that are in immediate danger of being killed in those scary animal shelters. I've, uh, I've been here for four and a half years the last two as chief dog officer of the rescue. See, we have the entire floor. So this is my kingdom, as far as the eye can see. This is our receptionist, Blue. Bluebird, the blue man, the blue ramarama. Blue's been with us for forever, right Blue? I hired him for his looks. It's always good to keep a gorgeous boy at the front desk, right? Today, I am in charge of picking a great new logo for us, right? That's what this is all about. Does that make me an artist? Uh, well, yes, in a way. Yeah, like a specialist. Tasia Blue is a consummate researcher, a workaholic, constantly scouring the internet to know everything there is to know about dogs and the breed trying to understand what the other Siberian Huskies are doing and always, always trying to find out even more and more about what makes a Siberian Husky tick. She is the expert. People are always coming to me. Tay, I have a secret. You're the only one I trust. No thanks, because keeping a secret can only lead to trouble. Like I was watching the Animal Planet last weekend, in this movie, Portrait of a St. Bernard or something like that, and the lead character, Fluffy, is framed for digging holes in the yard. So she goes on the run and winds up working in a circus in Malibu. I don't, I don't want to live like that. I like it here. I don't want to be Fluffy. I like being Tasia Blue. <laughs> Um, yeah. No. Yeah. All right. Tell them we've got room for them. Okay. Thanks. Bye. One thing is sure around here. We'll never have a cat burglar break in. Why have I stayed here for so long? Certainly not because of the paycheck. Because I could be making more money as a doctor, or even a professional athlete. I think it's because they respect me. A boss that will not fire you, even though you just barked at me, right to my face, over that bone, that's respect. 
Sorry about that. What a miss. Do I worry when the board has a meeting without me? No, because we're all amigos. And once in a while, one of the amigos will go off, like to the bathroom, while the others have a secret meeting. It happens. That's how we got staplers in the office. Our dedicated, loving, volunteer families open their homes to foster and rehabilitate these beautiful dogs as we ultimately find them loving families and forever homes. Saving Huskies. It's what we do. Thank you for joining us. Have a pleasant tomorrow. Good night.